Young and the Restless Spoilers next week reveal that after hearing Tucker's plan will include Kyle's help and Audrey must find a way to gain Kyle's trust again. She was angry and went to find Tucker to ask why Kyle was included in this rivalry story while Kyle was someone Audrey never thought about taking advantage of him in this matter. Abby's worried about her mother's love story. She wants to know what kind of relationship Chance and Sharon have, if they're compatible and happy with each other. She wants to know if the two of them can move forward with each other. Abby's excessive curiosity and concern made Sharon feel unhappy, and she said that nothing bad happened and everything was going very well. Although Sharon likes Chance, their love story is hindered by Summer. Although she knew her heart well, as for Chance, she could not guess whether he had love for her or not, and Summer and Chance's long-term friend from a very young age because of those things, she now feels like a third person. Jack and Diane have reached the final step of love, which is marriage. Mammy expressed her joy and truly blessed the two of them. This time, Mammy returns to the city. She wants her family to be close and happy with each other again. But Devin and Nate don't care about any of this. They have their own plans and their own battles. Nate thinks that what Mammy is doing is the right decision, but Devin, it will be difficult for him to accept what Nate did before. He betrayed the trust Devin gave him, but Nate had no intention of returning or doing anything that would be detrimental to Devin. He now just wants to do a good job at Newman. Nate couldn't appease those angers, but he still hoped that Devin and he would clear up these misunderstandings. Jack and Diane are happy, and this is the time they feel happiest. Because the two of them did not want strangers or anyone to ruin their party, they hired a security team to ensure that their party could take place smoothly and only guests with invitations just invited to go in there. While having fun outside, Tucker's making a mess and wants to meet Jack and Billy because of Tucker's noise and loud noise voice. One of the guards came to Jack and informed him of this. Jack didn't want to interrupt the party and let the party pass happily, so he called Billy to where Tucker was waiting and talked. Tucker will insist on delivering the wedding gift to Jack and Diane, so he will act as if the box on the table is a peace offering. Tucker came here with the wish of congratulating happiness and hoping that there would be peace, but with someone as scheming and fake as Tucker. It's hard to believe what he is. Jack asked Tucker to leave immediately. The two of them argued loudly with each other. Right now, Devin and Abby are witnessing the loud words and arguments between, breaking out between the two. Because of Tucker's plans, Audra was present at Jack and Diane's party. She wanted to come to here to meet Kyle and hope the two would come back. But the person facing her was not Kyle, but Nikki. When Nikki asked why Audra was here, she said that Kyle invited her, but this was a lie. Kyle did not invite her here. Audra wants to reconnect with her old love with Kyle because, because both of them still have feelings for each other. This caused Audra and Nikki to have conflicts. The two of them will definitely have confrontations, and Kyle is the one who will witness these. Please subscribe to Weiner Channel to update the latest news.